got a few of these concrete anchor bolts. I'm gonna attach a two by four underneath where the island is going. It has legs on all sides, so it will stand on its own. Just to keep it from ever being able to move, I am going to affix it to the concrete below. On pre-built cabinets, they'll sit right on the floor. If you were to look at them from the side, it would look a little bit like this. This being the front of the cabinet. There'll be a recessed area under here for your toe kick, and this portion will sit directly on the floor. Ikea cabinets aren't made that way. You build just the frames of them from the side. It'll just be a box. And then in all four corners, you'll attach adjustable legs that you can screw in and out to adjust the height of the cabinet. And against the wall, these will be attached to a rail in the back that would keep them from ever tipping over. Out here in the open for this island, there's nothing for it to attach to. I thought about building a pony wall behind it for it to attach to, but to keep this footprint as small as possible for these cabinets, I'm gonna just add some framing underneath here. I'm probably just gonna stack up three two by fours and then attach it from the inside to it so it can't ever tip over. And this bottom one, I'll anchor directly into the concrete. I am using a treated two by four on the very bottom of the framing. It's not actually touching the concrete. Just better safe than sorry. I am gonna make that piece treated.
think I'm gonna start wrapping up for the night. It is currently 7.47. I'm exhausted. This island has been a beast to put in. I don't know why, but this one was heck trying to get it put together and leveled. I haven't done an island in a little bit. I'm not even sure like how I did the last one. I don't know if I built a complete base or did like this one where I just put a brace in the middle and then try to level it with the legs. It may have been easier just to build a base underneath this and just set the whole thing on top of that instead of trying to level the legs. Either way, it's done. It's level. It's really bright. The only thing I have left to do is to make sure that my distance is exactly right all the way down from one end to the other away from this cabinet because right now I can move this thing around a little bit. The plumbing's in it in that second cabinet but I can still kind of wiggle it a little bit. I want to make sure I've got an equal distance all the way across from this cabinet to these cabinets. But that won't take long. It's just fastening with a couple of screws after I check my measurements on everything. So I'm gonna wait and do that in the morning because I'm tired and I'm hungry, so I'm gonna have to go home and get me something to eat. But, God willing, I'll be back here tomorrow. And if so, that'll be the next scene. And it's the next day. Now I just need to double check my measurement on these and then bolt them down. This feels really solid now, so all I need to do is start putting on the doors, drawers, and all the side panels, cover panels, etc. And again, I said it before, I'm skimming over a lot of this information, but if you want a more detailed view on how to do any portion of this, again, here's the link to that video series right here. Those videos I go into way more detail on all the little ins and outs of how to do this. I just didn't want to do another video just repeating the same thing. And plus it really slows down the process. stop for the night it is currently 9 20 p.m really tired really hungry <sighs> i tried to get as much of this done as possible but i didn't get completely done i've gotten about two-thirds of the island done or three-fifths to be exact. I finished this whole section, then I realized that the guy who had redone our plan online from Ikea, he had mixed up the location of a couple of these things. He had put this as the location for the prep sink. It's actually in the island here. So I had to swap the doors I put on here and move them over here. Most of this is done. This is kind of a unique drawer. I think it's a pull out for recycling. I'm not sure. I have to go back and look at the plan on that one, but it was a little bit different configuration, so I didn't do that one yet. Tomorrow, I'm gonna go to Memphis. I got some Ikea stuff that was, we just had too many of that I returned, and a couple of panels were wrong. I have to swap those out. So tomorrow will be mostly me going, returning stuff, and buying a few things from Ikea. I'll try to film a little bit of that if I can. Some of these stores do not like you bringing a camera in. If I am able to film tomorrow in any of these stores, I may cut to that footage now. If not, I'll end this one here. As always, please like, comment, subscribe. It helps us out. And yep, that's it. Thank you for watching.